the reason that naming convention for your test is very important is because just by looking at the name, you can know exactly what the test does. It's very useful. It's going to save you guys a lot of time. Imagine if you have thousands of tests and something that say like successful login test or valid user test or valid login test. How annoying is that? You have no idea what is being tested, what the expected outcome is. And so therefore now you have to sit and dig through the code so that you can figure out what the test does. Absolutely not. Name your tests to let you know what functionality is being tested and what is the expected behavior. And I'm going to be recording all of the best practices for you guys here so that you can visually see exactly what we were talking about. And then I'm definitely going to quiz you guys on it.